welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing something a bit different. I'm gonna do a hair tutorial. So my makeup's already on. This is from another video. It's the Lord & Berry makeup event. Um, I was going to an event and this was the makeup that I wore to it. So um, if you wanna watch that and see how the, I've achieved this makeup, please do so. But basically, this is literally sometimes, well, I say sometimes, practically every day how I wake up and this is like blasted off hair and I'm going to show you how I get the um, hair that's on most of my Instagram pictures like a nice soft beachy wave. So it's really simple all you will need is a large pair of straightening irons and a couple of products. So these are the products Baptiste hairspray love this and this is the Colab dry shampoo. Do you know what I really love this because it doesn't make your hair all white and powdery but it gives it that same kind of texturized uh drying effect at the root starts off just above the ears take a large section clip the hair out of the way just two clips part it at the back bring it forward i always just brush it through with a tangle teaser then these are my straighteners the, these are cloud nine so we clamp the hair in Put them on the highest temperature and very slowly turn the iron as you drag it out. So I don't um, like the ends to be too, too curly so I kind of put it out quite fast at that point. Same again on this side. So I move the tongue quite slowly round at the top to create the largest amount of curl. And then as you come to the end, like you see now, I've just got this little piece left. I just pretty much drag it straight out. Then I just spray it with the dry shampoo. At the root, and I spray the hair a little bit as well, so I find it just gives it a bit of texture. Okay, next section right at the top of the forehead just making very small round section let's take that clip these away and then i leave the curls at the front so i know what i've done picking it all up parting it again and again probably this time just take like three sections each side it's really really quick if I wasn't talking all the way through and explaining it would take me about five to ten minutes so clamping the iron in at the root turning as we go one done split this into two Clamp it in. This is how just to get a nice, soft, beachy, everyday wave. This is like what I would do on most of my clients, like Fern and Charlotte Crosby and Lydia. Just going what a nice, soft wave. With with Denise, she's got shorter hair, so if you've got shorter hair, I use my smaller tongue. I actually use the uh, old original GHD ones. And last one. So when at the front here, this always needs to go away from your face. So you're clamping it in like this and turn it back away from your face. And you can do these ones a bit faster because they're um there's less hair and you don't want them super ringlet curls. Oops. Just 
Just forgot to spray. Let the top down. Fall into parting. Okay, so I cut a little bit of a long kind of grown out fringe in. So this will probably just be split into three as well. Normally what I do through the top here is I just push back with the tangle teeth to create a little bit of volume and then just spray that section. Curl. Push back, literally just like back home, but a bit softer. And then getting away from the face. That's it, curled. And then these front bits can be a bit tricky. You have to do them quite quickly so you don't they don't go too curly. But I just literally just flick them back. That's it. We want perfect. See how quick it is, just got these last three bits. Got it all. Yeah. Oh no, that's already been cut. Even easier. Right. Push back. Two, three times, spray. This side can sometimes be a bit harder because you're changing hands, but just remember just to still be going backwards. That's probably a bit curly for my liking. So if it goes like that, I just straighten it over. And by leaving it in the um, curls and not brushing it straight out, it allows it to set whilst it cools down naturally. Last piece. And then just do this front bit. Okay, so I'm just gonna put a little bit more spray on the root and then literally use my tangle teaser. Wash it all out. And that is it. I quite like it looking all sort of quite um, full and sort of wavy but if you wanted to keep the curls in a bit more you can separate with your fingers instead of using a brush then i'm just going to finish off with a little bit of the baptiste hairspray so what i do is to make sure these bits stay put just literally spray them directly and then you can just use your fingers to style them and that is it just how quick was that really nice and soft Really beachy, natural, everyday, perfect, easy hair tutorial. So I really hope you've enjoyed that and you get to recreate it at home. And tag me if you do, I'd be really interested to see your recreations. Thanks so much for watching guys and let me know if there's anything else you want to see or if you want to see more hair videos, just let me know and write a comment down below.